What's up guys, Echo here, and in today's video, I'm going to give you tips for Cypher in low elo ranked. Some of these tips could help you kill Joy mains out there, but Sage, just get the fuck out of here. Number one, switching your setups. You don't have to switch all of your abilities into different places, just don't keep them at the same place every round. Just switch them up every now and then. You can put one tripwire into a different area, or change your camera into a different place. As long as the enemy doesn't know where your abilities are, you're fine. I already have a video about setups on every map if you guys want to watch it. Number 2. Lurking For you guys who don't know what lurking is, it is a player who silently goes to another part of the map trying to get a pick or gain control of a site and is also away from the players going to another site. So for example, if your team is going A, you go B. Be silent though so that you can kill them from behind. Also, don't lurk every round and don't lurk at the same spot every round or you will be predictable. Some rounds, stick with your teammates, some rounds, you can lurk. I've seen way too many people not do this, which is tripping your flanks. Like that is one of your main jaws as a cypher. If you don't, then they can flank you from behind every round. And even if they have a jet, raise, your, or omen, at least all the other agents can get over your trips. And also, don't put them too low or too high. You can correct this by crouching and leveling the tripwire to your head. When you're not lurking and going for team, grab the spike and support your teammates. Look, you're most likely going to be last every time you're going to a site, and typically the site will be cleared, so all you have to do is just plant the spike and play post plant. And last but not least, do not always rely on your abilities. I sometimes do this too by relying on my abilities every round on defense. You don't have to stay back every round and let your other teammates kill them off while you're sitting in the back waiting for someone to trip your traps. You can also push up and try to get a pick or be in an off angle and try to catch them off guard. Just be unpredictable. For example, one round you can push them and get a pick and another round you can play passive and kill them with your abilities. That's all for this video boys. If you guys want more content like this, subscribe and like this video. I'll see y'all kings later.